how to learn Russian effectively and stop wasting your time and motivation. This is what this video is all about. My name is Daria. If you don't know, I'm a Russian language teacher from Real Russian Club. And here I'm starting a new series of videos where you can ask me your questions about learning Russian. So today's question, how to learn Russian effectively. I'm going to share my top five rules for effective learning. Let's go. Number one, have a plan. Unfortunately, a lot of people think it's super easy, they don't need grammar, and they will just nail it by themselves. No, you will be lost in two weeks, I promise you. You need a plan. First of all, the best option is to hire a teacher. A lot of teachers charge about $10 for an hour and a half, and they will help you to um, make a path in learning Russian. Otherwise, it's very easy to get lost. If you're studying on your own, you should have a textbook. It can be one of the Russian language textbooks made for foreign students written by amazing authors uh, and there are a lot of exercises a lot of audio listening and if you don't want to study with uh, the textbooks try at least some study guides for yourself like penguin maybe they are all available on amazon if you are a pirate you can even find it online if you don't have money Anyways, the goal here is to follow a plan. Otherwise, you will be lost and disappointed and will just quit learning Russian at all. On YouTube, you can join my series uh, From Zero to Fluency and uh, just to follow the right order of grammar. I will put the link below this video. Number two, study every single day. And I'm not joking. Studying every day is much more effective than studying a couple of days per week. So please, every day, dedicate some time to learning the Russian language and you will get the results that you want and you deserve. Number three, start small. Unfortunately, so many students at the very beginning are super motivated, are extremely excited. They are ready to study for five hours per day. And then guess what? It's very easy to burn out. And after a month, you hate the Russian language completely. So please don't make this mistake. It's really very common. Start small and set a goal of studying for 20 minutes. Yes, not 20 hours, 20 minutes every day. Because the concentrated studying, I mean, not hanging out in your phone, not having any snacks, just really dedicated, concentrated studying for 20 minutes is much more effective than just ah, whatever, let's study some Russian for a couple of hours. It doesn't work that way. Also, if you extend this time to maybe 30 or 40 minutes, which is quite easy, you will feel amazing and great about yourself. It will motivate you more. So set yourself a small goal and maybe extend it a little bit in the process just to feel good. Number four, stop jumping around. A lot of people are studying like this. They find one program, they find five podcasts, they find 10 YouTube channels, and they are just jumping from one place to another uh, without making any progress. It's a waste of time. I'm honest with you, it's a waste of time. I know that you would say like, Daria, but you always recommend other teachers and you always insist that you can't learn from one person. Yeah, but you should be smart in your choice uh, anyway. You can't just jump around forever. It's better to dedicate some time before you actually go deeper. You should make a research or do a research. 
English grammar time. Okay, so spend some time researching and try to understand what works for you and stick to that program. Don't listen to 10 different podcasts. Don't uh, follow 10 different online courses at the same time. You will not finish uh, one of them if you are following several together. So choose one thing and complete it. Only after that, go to another course, go to another program, but make progress in one area first. Otherwise, again, you will be demotivated, you will be overwhelmed, frustrated, and you will think that the Russian language just is not for you. And it's not true. It's all about your approach. So please, no jumping around. Concentrate and study effectively. Number five, and this one is the most important one. I call it enjoyment test. Please, every time when you are starting to feel a little bit strange, ask yourself, am I actually enjoying what I'm doing? Am I having fun? Is it interesting? So if you're going through a bunch of exercises and uh, you catch this thought uh, like, uh, I don't, I'd rather go for a walk or I'd rather watch Netflix. If this happens, that's a red signal. You should stop immediately, put it away, go watch your Netflix and learn Russian only when you are completely involved, only when you are enjoying it, only when you love what you are doing. If it's super boring, it only means that you are using the wrong resources. It means that you need to do more research to find what you actually like. Otherwise, again, don't blame the Russian language, blame your approach to learning it. So those were my five rules for learning the Russian language effectively. Please, under this video in the comments, it would be amazing if you can share your learning routine and uh, uh, which uh, methods you apply. Do you have any tricks and tips for other learners? Because it's great to have a community of like-minded people. So maybe somebody will read through your comments and uh, get some idea how to improve their learning routine. Also, if you have some questions for the future videos, like how to learn Russian, what's the difference between this and that, how to learn verbs effectively. So any questions about the Russian language, you are very welcome to ask them in the comments. That's it for today. Thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.